Healers Cadets assistant coach Josh Reyes likes what he sees from the 23 for 2023 squad, even after opening their Phil Oil Flying V Premier Cup campaign with a loss at the hands of Ateneo on Saturday. Stepping in for coach John Mutico, Reyes gave his squad a passing mark, especially since they've only been together for a week. I believe we competed quite well considering that we only had six practices, and in those practices we weren't complete. And Kobe, Paras, only had three practices, said Reyes. Saying that, we were able to stay with Atenio in the game. There was one stretch where they pulled away. Hindi Pakami and sink offensively. Despite all those, there were a lot of errors, but there's also around a lot of promise, he added. While the lack of practices and cohesiveness will definitely make things difficult for them, Reyes and the coaching staff is using that as a challenge for the players to step up early on. It's hard to demand for the whole game. The team system is not yet installed, yet so we're there to how to instruct them to do things and limit turnovers. But that's the challenge we are giving them, Reyes explained. They need to play the right way despite not having the practices that will lead them to 100%, he added. Reyes said that it's now a matter of making the most out of the time given to them, granted that most of these players are still studying. We are bound by the schedules of their mother teams. We were advised to not having practices more than three times a week. With their school and practices, it will be too much to ask of them according to their schools. 